Hello guys, my name is Rishi Guba, and today I'm going to show you how to make Steve from Minecraft's arm. First, click on the sketch option and select the top plane as your sketch plane. Right click and view normal to the sketch plane. Click on the center point rectangle option and create a rectangle in the middle. We're going to hold alt to make it a square. We're going to make it 2 inches in diameter. In, we're going to make the dimension 2 inches. Then we're going to click on the green tick mark. After that, select the extrude option and extrude the square we made. The depth is going to be 2 inches so we can make it a cube. Now we're going to extrude the bottom of this cube we made. So go to the bottom and extrude the cube. The bottom of the cube. We're going to make it a new because otherwise it won't work. And the depth is going to be 4 inches. Then we're going to click on the green tick mark. After that, we're going to click sketch. And go to the right right side of our arm. And we're going to sketch on this bottom rectangle here. We're going to select the line option. And make it coincident to this point, And make it connect to this line. And then we're going to make the dimension. The, the, the angle of this line. 178, 178 degrees. Then we're going to click on the green tick mark. After that select the extrude option. And click on remove. And remove this part. Of the sketch we're gonna make it through all and then we're gonna click on the green tick mark after that click P to remove all the planes and hide origin to remove the origin then we're gonna change the part then we're gonna change the appearance of the arm so go to part one and right click and make it say click on edit appearance and we're gonna change the code right here in this right here and we're gonna say zero e a e a e then we're gonna click on the green tick mark after that we're gonna go to part two right click edit appearance and we're gonna make it a nine seven d six four then we're gonna click on the green tick mark after that we're gonna change it to trimetric view and then we're gonna create we're gonna rename this part studio. I'm gonna rename it arm. And then I'm gonna click on the insert new element and create an assembly. In this assembly, I'm gonna insert our arm we made. And then click on the green tick mark. After that, I'm gonna move the cube away so I can see bo both of the I can see the top face of this rectangle and the bottom face of this cube. And click on the fasten mate. I'm going to go to the, the top face of the rectangle, pres rectangular prism. And go to the middle and make sure the Z axis is pointing up. Then I'm going to go to the bottom face of this cube. And make sure the Z axis is pointing down and it's in the middle. Then we're going to click on the green tick mark. After that we're going to go to trimetric view. And then hide the origin. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's called Cad Legend and it's by Rishi Guba. Thank you and bye.